What's up guys, this is Mix Reeve and Ryan from VDeck Smiths. <laughs> Here we're coming with Mix and his newest deck. We've been trading all day for San Jose. Let's do this, baby. Alrighty, so. What do we have, baby? What do you have? Heck, so yeah. So right now we're going with something that probably nobody has used yet. Good old Bobby. So. Get the 4K yeah. digitized. So anybody that, that is working on Bobby, hey, maybe this can help you out. Still not com a complete deck, but it's a work in progress, and I do like how it works. Version one, baby, version yep. one. So the auto is just nothing big. He just at the beginning of the turn, he just gets you boost ball sacks. <laughs> we'll jump into that in a second, but let's go right on with the deck. Um, of course, he is one of the leaders that can awaken with six life and under. Awaken. When he's awakened, that's when this card, this card becomes pretty. Retarded. So, active main once per turn. You can give one of your your battle cards plus 5k for the turn. So it gives him a little boost. The auto once per turn. It's only once per turn. So, in a way, you gotta make sure who you're swinging with first. Um, when one of your battle cards attacks, you draw one card and you take one card from the top of your deck and place it under booze ball sacks. So the whole purpose of the deck is you gather a lot, um, five cards under the boost sealed ball, awaken, then bring out the the ten drop, boo. So we're gonna jump right on to that. So it's a work in progress, but there is gonna be changes going along. So to start, you got your four Hercule. Um, search the top seven for a red boo. Mm -hmm. Four Mighty Mass, this lets, you can, this lets me get the Goten and the Trunks, so I can search Gotenks. Mm -hmm. The Boost Attack Piccolo for red, you'll be a dummy not to run it. Don't even run red if you don't run it. Right? Four of Bobby's Goonies. An auto, when the card attack, you can, optional, you can place up to, you can place up to one card from top under the Bobby Ball under the blues ball. <laughs> so he's also one card that helps you accelerate it. Um, for this one, paired up two trunks and two go tanks. It didn't feel the need to run three or four. I think two was actually a perfect number. Four Deboras. Oh god, I hate this card. Permanent, as long as he's in rest mode, they cannot attack any Bobby. So in order for them to get to a Bobby, they gotta go after him first. <laughs> and just imagine if you have two or three of them out in play at once. They have to kill each of them. Three, Goat 10, the Prodigy Fusion. The reason why this one and not the five drop. Um, easier to summon. If I ever go late game, I could just evolve over it. And besides, in this, you would never bring out the five drop Go 10 because of one card which I will get to in, a, in I will get to and it's much easier to obtain. Four Dark Prince Vegeta. It's auto when he KOs a battle card. Put cards from the top of your deck under the boo seal ball until you have five. So if you don't got the Goonies or he's not awakened, he's the he's plan B. Mm. And just awaken it really quick. Delicious. <laughs> for Awakening Evil, um, if you go to turn 5 and you can afford it, of course, go right ahead and play it. Other than that, you could just use two reds to go over to evolve pretty much the 10 drop blue that you bring out for two red. And then, of course, the Union Absorb, place a card under this card, go into any of your boosts, 25 or more from your deck, and put it on top. Two mind controls, only reason why two, not four or three, I'm not focusing it on bringing this card out. This card is a last resort, depending on how far, how late in the game is brought out. Four, Prodigy Absorption, um, has an evolve for five, double strike, his permanent, if Golten is under him, and the opponent has no cards in their combo area, he cannot be KO. So he just sits there, of course, laughing at you. And again, for me, it was no point to put the five drop Goten if I'm never going to summon him. So that's why I just got the four drop. 
Last but not least, out of the battle cards, four of the 10 drop boots. Double strike and auto when it comes into play because of the effect of the seal ball, you, the opponent takes one life. Now, I, the reason why I do not have Grand Absorption, um, Grand Absorption Majin Buu, the seven drop, no extra Gohans, no extra promo Gohans, but like I said, it's a work in progress. The deck can actually work without it. Of course, the deck will be even more retarded with those <laughs> added, added into it. To go to the extras, some negate for Vados assistance. Of course, negate an attack and ready the battle card. And last but not least, that one ball sack. Pretty much when it's on, when this card has five or more. Send it to the drop area and get the, the 10 drop Majin boost. That makes sense. So, of course, yeah. The only thing I'm missing in this, outside of the promo Gohan and the Miraculous, which is I'm only going to be running them in two twos and four grand absorptions. I'm also I'm trying to fit in here on um, Kaba's Awakening, that plus 6k for free. But so far has worked out. Even gave right in some sweat. So. Uh, have you played? Uh, have you ever played Go Tanks uh, using fusion by itself? Um, not yet. I mean, seeing that only the Go, the Go Ten and the Trunks are only in two, and their only purpose really is to search the Go Tanks. Oh. I never really, I almost did, but never really ended up bringing it out. I mean, it's pretty cool if you actually pull them off. I mean, a dual attack for 15, which is not that bad. But other than that, I haven't really brought them out as mm -hmm. much. But, yep. Thank you, Mix. This is the deck Smiths. Thank you very much for your Bobby deck. Here we have Reef doing his own deck. <laughs> <laughs>